My name is Glenn Phillips. I'm the design engineer at Joan Active Systems. Joan Active Systems was developed by Dr. Peter Benuti. What Joan Active Systems does is it develops devices to, for range of motion of the body. So if you have a stiff elbow, or have surgery or an injury to your elbow, you have a device that you put on your elbow and it would stretch your, your elbow. So it's a rehabilitation as opposed to a support arms. This is a cuff device, so this would, this would kind of go on your arm like that. Correct. That would be attached to a, a pronation supination device um, frame and this hand plate would actually go on your forearm and it would rotate your forearm in pronation, supination and pronation. So it would stretch your forearm muscles. And this is actually a shoulder device. We, we supply cuffs for about 1,500 to 2,000 customers a month. Some devices make, take three cuffs, some devices take two cuffs. Um, depending on the device. All of the patients, usually a therapist measures the patient for their sizes and stuff, and then we have just sizing charts that the measurements are, are compared against to determine which size of cuffs. And also their, their measurements tell us if we need to cut off a cuff and customize the cuff and, and make modifications to it, or we can even make modifications onto the mold whenever they're, they're vacuum forming. Vacuum forming is one of the most important parts of our product's development formed on the Formac vacuum forming machines. The reason we do it that way is we used to buy our cuffs and they were expensive. So we started off with a two foot by two foot Formac vacuum former and used it for prototyping and we developed how to make our own cuffs. It makes them more reasonably priced. But definitely the vacuum forming, it's probably the most important part because it also, with these cuffs, they gotta be sized to fit the patient and good vacuum forming allows us to size those cuffs better. Well, we chose Formac because of the compact size you know, and they're easy, easily accessible, so you can get to the mold and the tooling on them easily. And they're also very versatile for what we do here at Joint Active Systems. The Formac vacuum formers, you know, we use all manual machines and semi-automatic machines due to the reason that we change out our molds constantly throughout the day. And being able to easily change the tooling and, and molds through, um, is very important with us. Just looking at this forming from the 660 that they just made, the shoulder pad, and you can see the, the quarter inch foam and the quarter inch thick polyurethane. And the two, they end up bonding together. So it's kind of an interesting process. There's loads of holes in the foam and it, and it actually bonds directly to the plastic. It, the plastic pulls through the holes. So it's kind of a neat little forming and these are where the trim lines are gonna be, you can see. Yeah, it's kind of an interesting one. So. This whole device goes as far as it's a shoulder device, a bicep device, and a pelvic device that is all on this. So this and other multiple devices as far as cup-wise is going to go with it. So the first thing, we do that rough cup. So we're just going to get rid of the edges. As our production um, needs increase and stuff, we we actually considered probably not upgrading a machine, but possibly adding another machine to to keep up with our volume of, of cuffs that we have to make throughout the day. So.